Hello, Victor Tay, pastor of the church in Liverpool and Liberal Democrats candidate for Werriwa. This afternoon we're at Edmondson Park train station, a bit of a rainy day. Um, we're handing out flyers undercover and uh, talking to the local residents. Now, the cost of living is on everyone's mind, and rightly so, because the government has made it so bloody expensive to live and work in Australia. And that's on top of what they did to us over the past few years with lockdowns and restrictions. But the Liberal Democrats have real solutions to ease the cost of living and put more money in your pocket without borrowing and spending our children's future into oblivion. For example, we want to reduce the income tax rate to a low flat 20% and increase the tax-free threshold to $40,000. You know, we want to uh, abolish the fuel excise completely and permanently. Uh, we want to remove the ban on nuclear, so the market is free to develop the uh, safest, cheapest, cleanest, and most reliable form of energy. But it's more than just the direct impact of keeping more of your income and reducing the amount you pay at the pump or paying less on your electricity bill. These policies also reduce the cost of businesses for manufacturing, storage, logistics, refrigeration, transportation, so on and so forth. So lower costs means lower prices for you at the shops or online. So this is why the Liberal Democrats policies for small business will help your hip pocket even if you don't run a business because the less money businesses have to pay in taxes or spend to comply with excessive red tape the more can be passed on to you in the form of lower prices and higher wages. So if you want real and sensible solutions to the rising cost of living this election, vote for less government and more freedom. Vote one, Victor Tay, Liberal Democrats for Werriwa. Visit victortay.com.au to learn more and download our Freedom Manifesto, which outlines our 10 policies for the coming federal election. Authorised by Rob Cribb for the Liberal Democrats, Sydney.